Mecca? Yeah. You been to Mecca? You been made to your heart. heart. I made my heart. Okay, now when you made yeah. your heart, what all you did at your heart? I, mean, I prayed. Okay, what else? And I did, I, I mingled with the people. And what else? And that's it. You ain't made no heart. <laughs> you ain't gonna lie, man. You was Catholic, girl. So this is why you said you made a heart, right? Yeah. Why did you pick up rocks and throw rocks at the rock? I mean, because that's what we did. But why do you do it, though? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe all count, Papa. Papa, you all will count, Papa. Shalom Israel, this is Bishop Nathaniel. I want you to know that you can view all our Sabbath classes live on IUIC TV. That's right, I said on IUIC TV. Download the app today. Shalom. God gave you that body, right? Uh huh, yes. So he said, no piercing, no tattooing. No that's a law. That's, that's, that's a law in the Bible. That's perfect. Okay, so that's a law. Like, yeah. But here's, a, here's another order. Get me, get me Exodus 20 and 3. I, I, I know that. Okay, if you know it, everybody else gotta know, know it. Right. So be be mindful that, and help right? everybody else know it. But I've been there. Exodus I've chapter been. 20 and verse 3. Uh -huh. Thou shalt have no other gods before me. So the Bible says right. you shall have no other gods. Who is that God? The God of Israel. Right. The one and true, only living oh, God. God. Right. Allah is that God. Allah is that God? That, that Allah God. is a pagan God about the moon. Who? So, so he, he is that God right there? Nope. They didn't say Allah. Right. So you said Israel? The God of Israel who created everything. He created us? He created us. No, I'm just mad. Okay, no, let's go into your history no. of Islam, right? No. How? No. Question. How did your people learn Islam? How did you run into that religion? Because I, I, your I, forefathers, my forefathers, just like Esau, Esau, and all of them, I believe in them. Okay, yeah, yeah, they just like. So, us. where did Islam come from? Did it, Islam come from Esau, yeah, no, Jacob, no, or Ishmael? It, Adam, Ishmael, Adam, Adam, Adam didn't teach that, right? Yeah. Adam taught God's laws. Yeah, That's right. right. No, he disobeyed God. He disobeyed God. He said. Where? No, did Adam Islam did not come from my Bring it up. But hey, yo. Can you answer that question for me? Yes. Okay. I, I did. I did. I just said. No, Islam. Islam. It came from Esau. It came from Esau? Yeah. No, Islam did not come from Esau. Right. Islam did not come from Esau. And on top of it, if it did come from Esau, that's the worst person to <laughs> <Right. laughs> Then you would be doomed. Break it out. Hey, yo, just okay, like let me, Adam. Let me, let's give yeah, you, let hey, me give yo, a little history like lesson. I'm thinking in Esau. Esau? Yeah, meaning Jesus. That's what I did. That part. He, he said it wrong. Right there. Okay, okay. But you think Islam right came from there. Jesus? Yeah. Jesus does not speak about Islam at all. Right. It's a new religion. Because, right. But he was born from there. He wasn't. See, here's the thing. Uh, these are lies that you've heard from Muslims, right? That, 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 that Islam always existed and predated all other beliefs. That's what you've heard. I'm telling you, that's not true. You know why? God only deals with the children of Israel. Get me Psalms 147, verse 19. Him, him. Me? 34. Yes, let me get that. My daughter older than you. And guess what? I have the knowledge of God because I keep his commandments. That's right. Guess what? You can be 80 years old. If you do not keep the commandments, you do not get the understanding. Right. You can't do one without the other. Right. And that's what God says. Let's read it. Psalm chapter 147, verse 19. Uh -huh. He showeth his word unto Jacob. He showeth his word unto Jacob. Read. His statue. And his judgment unto Israel. He's my brother. You got to listen. It's my fault. <laughs> Let's read this again for you. Read. Read. Chapter one forty-seven, verse nineteen. We're reading out of the book of the law. God, read. He shook 
his word unto and Jacob. Hold on, wait, 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 wait. He said he showed his word unto Jacob. Who's right. Jacob? And yo, Jacob is the father of the twelve tribes of Israel. Yeah. 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 Very specific. And yo, he showed his word unto Jacob, yeah. right? That's he did not show his word to Ishmael. He showed his word unto Jacob. Right. And Read yo. his statutes and his judgments unto Israel. Look, 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 the statue, listen, listen, my brother. Listen, listen, you're not, you're interrupting every chance you get. I'm trying to read the scriptures for you to gain a little bit of understanding. Then, then rebuttal, but read. His uh -huh. statutes and his judgments unto Israel. Uh-huh, God gave his statutes and his judgments to Israel, read. He have not dealt so with any nation. He said, God is saying, he has not dealt so with any other nation. Do you know what that means? That means all the prophets that God dealt with was from the children of Israel. Yes, right? Right. So if God is saying that, where did Muhammad come from? Bring it out. Who Jeez. gave Muhammad the word? Right. He's not an Israel. And He's yo, not from the children of Israel. And yo, what so that, so what, Muhammad lied. What, what's the name of that and you are following a lie. Yeah. Well, let's give me the Babylon Tim Bucks. Give me the bad Let's give Yo, you more history. No. We're gonna give you history, my brother. Your 61 Ten years you on this on this earth, you're gonna learn the history. Whether you like it or not, you're gonna learn it. Read. From Babylon to Timbuktu, page 48. Uh -huh. These converts hey, could I readily accept no, Islam. No, this is the read. introduction of Islam. Bring it out. We're, we're reading a history book about the introduction of Islam. Read. See. These converts could readily accept Islam because they were influenced by a great extent by the concept of a one God of a Jews. So before, here's what, what you understand. You, here's what you understand. Muhammad, your so-called sacred prophet, he got the he got the idea from the Jews. Because so before the Jews, before the Jews, the, the so-called no, Arabs, didn't. the Arabs no, he had didn't. over 360 gods. That's right. That's right. So he switched from, he, so he got the Arabs to convert from 360 gods to one god, which you call Allah. And Allah was just the moon god right. in that time. Right. So you're just worshiping right. the moon. Bring it up. Question, what is the symbol? Hey, what is the symbol of Islam? Hey, yo, what's, what's the, the symbol of Islam? What's, what's that Bible from? Hey, what's the I'm name of that you, Bible? I'm asking you a question. I, Why are you deflecting, was, my brother? I'm asking my brother. What's your name again? Muhammad. Muhammad. Yeah. Why are you deflecting? I'm, because asking, I'm asking where that Bible come from. I'm not answer Bible? answer the question. Who the, who the name of that Bible? King James huh? Version. Uh huh. He's a homosexual. Oh, yeah. oh, 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 How many times are we gonna hear? He's a homosexual. This is like a broken tape recorder. Hey yo, but but this you is like know a broken tape recorder. Yo, yo, my brother, my brother, my brother. My brother, my brother. He was not a homosexual. Right. That that. That lie was, that lie came up hundreds of years after he died. And that was by a so-called white man who put that. Dude, I bet you didn't know, King James was a black man. Right. 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 We ruled Europe. Right. The same so-called Moors. Right. Right. We ruled Europe. Right. Right. We, we got the best Hebrew and Greek scholars to hey, translate the Bible. So what you're seeing is the most accurate description, translation of the Bible right. in the world. Right. Right. And now we're reading that to wow. you, but you don't want to listen. But you don't want to listen. So question, again, about Islam. Where did it come from? Yo, he's a homosexual. He was a homosexual. What proof do you have of that? Huh? Well, I'm gonna ask you. Because, hey, yo, I'm telling you, man, when it's, and when it's so uh, when out the war, Okay, your prophet Muhammad. Let me ask. Let me ask. Let me ask you. Your prophet Muhammad, right? Who was his wife? Damn. Who was his wife? Hey, read Leviticus chapter twenty-three. Bring it up. Bring it up. You know what I want. Yeah. Now listen to this. Listen to this. All right, you said King James was a homosexual, right? Yeah, yeah. All right, okay. Listen to this. Listen to this. All right, so what does what does that got to do with the Bible? Because listen to what the Bible saying. Bring it up. You know what I want. Leviticus chapter twenty-three, seventeen. Get me out, bro. Get over. Now you stay right here. Well, I'm, I'm, oh, it's that's crazy. crazy. You understand Leviticus. that? Leviticus. Okay, read. Leviticus chapter. Listen to it. Read. Leviticus chapter 18 and verse 22. Read. Thou shalt not lie with mankind. The Bible says. Right. Thou shalt not lie with mankind. 
Read. No, listen. As with woman kind. So a man shouldn't be doing what? Laying with down with another man like he lay down with a woman, right? So hold on. God is against what? The Bible is against what? Okay, then. So look, this is a translation that King James Commission. That's it. Look, hold on, listen. If he was a homosexual, why he sat up there and said, hey, you know what? Let's take that out. Read that again. Leviticus chapter 18, verse 22. Read. Thou shalt not lie with mankind. Read. As with womankind. The Bible said, don't lie down with mankind as with womankind. God is against homosexuality. Read, y'all. Abomination. It's just abomination. Hey, yo, but listen. You say what? Listen. I'm listening to you. So now, when his soldiers went out the war and they came back, he said, all right, we don't want your women. We want your young men. Who said that? King back. That ain't in the damn Bible. Man, you just making up some stuff, guys. Right, 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 right. I'm not here. I'm not No, nah, you making up some stuff. The Bible is against you. Hey, you know who came up with that lie about King James being a homosexual? A guy named James Wilkinson. He came up with that lie uh, 75 years, 75 years after King James death. That's a lie right there. Right. Just like the brother was trying to explain to you. King James, look, listen to me. And when, when you do, have you ever did true historical research on King James? Yeah. Okay, before he was King James first of England, what was he king of? And what was his name? I don't know. Before he was King no, James first of England, I, look. Before he was King James first of England, he was King James six of Scotland. Right. Did you know that? Don't lie. No, I said Who was Scotland know. ruled by? No. Bring Who was Scotland ruled by? It was by no. Scotland was ruled by black men. Right. right. From the time of the so-called Dark Ages. See, you don't know history, my brother. Right. See, you just look. For you to sit up there to defend the lie of Islam, you have to sit up there and make up some stuff, just like everybody else do. King James is a homosexual. The Bible is true. What the hell with King James? Right. We don't give a damn about King James. Right. We care about what the Word of God says. Right. That's why you read in Romans chapter three. Listen to this. Romans chapter three. What the hell with King James, man? Look, we gotta fix our community. Right. It's not man land uh, having sex with man. Yes. It's not woman having sex with woman. Yes. God said that's an abomination. Right. We gotta go out here and teach down people that God is against man laying with Jeez. man. Right. God is against woman laying with woman. Right. That's one thing that they ever forget, right? Man, they, they don't deal with that homosexual stuff. But guess who they get that from? They get them from us. Right. But goddamn black people, you know the reason why we sit up there and practice homosexuality so much, we don't got a damn thing to lose. That's why black people are so open about it in America. White people. They are more uh, they they are more homosexuals than us, but do they practice it openly like we do? No, no. Hell no, they don't, they don't they practice it openly. You know why? Cause they got things to lose. They father already told them, look, if you be if, if you lay down with another man, you ain't gonna get your inheritance. Dude. If you don't get married by this age, you ain't gonna get if if, if the woman do this, they ain't gonna get their inheritance. We don't got nothing in here. <laughs> so we practice these things openly. We oppress. So we practice, uh, black people practice homosexuality openly. But God is against that. Oh, uh, Romans 3 and 3. May God be true. Romans hey, chapter God, 3 hey, and verse 3. Read. For what if some did not believe, read. shall their unbelief make the faith of God without effect? So look, we don't really care that if people don't believe in the Bible. So your unbelief make what the Bible say untrue? Read. God forbid. Paul said God forbid, but listen to this, read. Yay, let God be true. Our thing is, is to let the word of God be true, read. But every man a liar. And every man, what the hell with King James? King James is a lie, but God is true. That's right. This is the version of the Bible that he commissioned the greatest Greek and Hebrew scholars at that time to sit up there to translate. Why? So we can have an accurate read of what the Bible says. Right. That's right. Simple as that. A lot of people sit up there and say, well, there's a lot of mistakes up in this Bible. No. What it is, is you got different people, I ain't gonna, I'm going to say it like this. Time has changed to where they spoke a certain type of way back then, well, when you read certain things in the Bible, you'll get an understanding of, because right, 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 to right. the way we speak now. Right, yeah, right, that's right, simple as that. That's why, right. even now, they got, what, the common English translation of the Bible, the good news testament of the Bible. They keep sitting up there, trying to sit up there. They try to simplify the way we read this as much as possible. Other than that, the law is on point. Right. The scripture says, let God be true and every man alive. Get that in uh, Exodus chapter 220 real quick. 
And verse 9. Hey, yo, I, hey, yo, I respect what you say. Like, yes, sir. I, I do. Yeah. I respect that. But you know, we got to come up out of that Islam religion. You know why? I'm going to tell you why. I, I Don't you know, been have you been to Mecca? Yeah. You've been to Mecca. I you made, made your heart. I made my heart. Okay, now when you made yeah. your heart, what heart you did at your heart? I, I, I prayed, uh, you know what I mean? I prayed. Okay, and, what else? And, and I did, uh, I mingled with the people. And what else? And that's it. You ain't made no hearts. <laughs> <laughs> okay, did you get the rocks? Did you pick up the rocks? That was my way. Did you throw rocks at the rock? Yeah, I picked So you picked up rocks and threw, so this is why you said you made a heart, right? Yeah. Why did you pick up rocks and throw rocks at the rock? Because that's what we did. But why do you do it though? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> hey, bro, you gotta wake up, man. No. You were not there until they did 81, man. I, just, I gotta wake up. You gotta wake up. Because you just said you went and did something, you don't know why you did what you did. Remember, the, when you make a hodge, right, you go to Mecca. They got the cobblestone set up. You gotta walk around the cobblestone, you gotta pray to it, you gotta throw rocks at the rock to do what? I, to fight off sin, right? Yeah. That's, that's the point of throwing them. See, I'm not a Muslim, but I understand why they do a lot of the stuff that they do. Right. You know what I'm saying? You gotta drink water from a certain family. You gotta do all types of stuff when you make the heart, and you did all that. Get man, you all count, Papa. Damn. Papa, you all count, Papa. Hey, yo, man, I got it on my phone. You got it on your phone. I got it. You got it on your phone. Let me see it. Let me see it. I got to see it. You got to see it. Let me see it. <laughs> Bring it up. Great. Hey, I'm going to leave you alone, Papa. Pop, what's your name, Papa? Mom. Huh? Mom. Mom. Huh? You got to repent, man. Look. Repent for what? Because we are the Israelites. Going That's, to right. That's, That's right. That's right. That's right. chosen people. Islam is idolatry. That's the average religion, man. You gotta repent. You gotta wake up. You didn't even show me that on your phone. That's why, look, I'm gonna show you something. You're in Leviticus chapter 19, verse 11. This is another law. And that's what I'm trying to say. The scripture said, let God be true and every man a lie. Right. We need you older. Look, look, Mahan, we need older men like you up in our community to teach the younger men right. and to set the example and to lead the way. But you, can, you can't lead them back into Islam, something that you don't even know nothing about. You sat up there and said, you said, you, made, you just said, look, you said you made a hodge, and I asked you, did you throw rocks at the rock? You said, yeah. I said, why did you throw rocks at the rock? You said, you don't know. I had to tell you why, if you threw the rocks at the rock, why you had to do it. I know more about what you say than you and two than you do. Listen to this, read. Leviticus chapter 19 and verse 11. My heart, listen to this, let's walk up, read. You shall not steal. The scriptures say we should not steal. This is the vow. The vow is a true book, read. Neither deal falsely. Or deal falsely, read. Neither lie one to another. Or lie one to another. You was up here lying. <laughs> you was capping up here. Damn. But it's all good because you still can repent. Uh, and that's why I said you can repent, man. Because look, Pop, Pop, we love you, Pop. Hey, I, I know you don't steal. I don't steal, but guess what? It's other sins that we do that we have that we must repent from. You said what? How you get your money, Pop? What'd you say? You said their part. Come on, Pop, their part. And see, look, that's another thing with Islam or our brothers that's a part of the Islamic community. Y'all. Y'all don't got no problem with selling drugs to your people. Right. Not to be saying you said, I ain't saying you sell drugs, but I'm saying that Muslims do that. Right. Muslims do that. You can go right now. I'm going to ask you something. If you, okay, look, go to one of these Arab stores or one of these uh, Islamic stores and buy pork. And tell, first tell them you're a Muslim. And then go in there and ask to buy pork and see if they sell it to you or not. Right. See if they respect you as being a Muslim. Right. These Islamic, uh, these so-called Arabs that's in our community that own these stores, they will sell you pork in a heartbeat. Right. Guarantee you, uh, Mahan. Mahan, it's time for you to wake up, repent, and keep the commandments of God. We are the Israelites, the Bible speaks of. Right. Y'all got to understand, you ain't getting the kingdom of heaven no other way. You can't come to the uh, kingdom of heaven, you ain't getting the kingdom of heaven being a Christian. Right. Or, or practicing Christianity. God is against Christianity. Right. You ain't getting the kingdom of heaven saying you is a Baptist. One of the Bible doesn't say you're supposed to be a Baptist. One of the Bible doesn't say you're supposed to be a Jehovah Witness. 
You ain't getting the kingdom of heaven coming as a bug. The only way to get the kingdom of heaven, you blacks and Hispanics got to repent as the Israelites. Hey. Hey. What is the nation? Nation is family. Nation is community. Nation is men leading by example. Nation is women's support. Nation is children with role models. Nation is unity. Nation is you.